Yo, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another video on Bubble. And inside of this video, I want to talk about the new Quincy Keto rework slash expansion update that we actually just got. And there actually is a new code as well. So we'll be talking about all that inside of this video. So if you guys end up enjoying it, like, subscribe, and join my Discord. It'll be linked inside the description down below. But the first thing that I'm going to go over is going to be the update log. And then I'll talk about what I actually think it's going to do to the meta and why I think this could actually be a very big meta change for Type Soul after this new Q, uh, Q Keto expansion update. But here you guys can see, the first thing is gonna be the new code, Q Keto expansion. Let's see the rewards. They're probably gonna be buns, but let's just see. Um, It's all right. It's not the worst code I've ever seen, but it's definitely not something like, go get this code right now. Um, It's kind of buns, I'm not gonna lie. I don't know why they keep on giving soul tickets. But anyways, here is basically what they added for Quincy Keto. Four new Quincy Keto moves. One new Quincy Keto skill box move, one new Quincy Keto ultra move, which is pretty cool. And then we have four new bows, but only one or two are inside the game right now. I showcased one if you guys want to see it on my channel, and I believe someone else showcased a different one. Um, they say you can now swap out your spirit bow by using an M2 on a side nabber box, which is cool. Um, added a new NPC in London to remove your cybernetic. I might have a showcase on that um, like right after this video. Uh, wave shot now upgrades when you get the 50 keto stat or above and shadow was hard nerf i'm not gonna lie basically 10 more seconds added to the cooldown and then here's some other stuff flying dragon has its stun back on the ground slam which is kind of cool and then uh reduced ground catching into flying and lag a bit so basically they made it so because if you guys don't know already basically every single person that was using catching dragon catching dragon just wasn't getting flying dragon because the amount of end lab that it actually has it just wasn't worth it you are better off going catching dragon than just doing like a barrage move into it and now they changed that but here you guys can see this is what quincy keto looks like i don't know what any of the new moves are i believe uh lit wind is this might be a new move this might be a new move this like i don't know what the new moves are so i'm not even gonna try to say what the new moves are but if you guys do want me to actually drop a pvp video playing with the new quincy keto all that you have to do is get this video to 300 likes now for my honest opinions on it, what I think it will do to the meta. Anything right when it gets an ultra skill is automatically completely broken and is meta defining because we only have speed and hot to with ultra skills. And now Quincy Keto has an ultra skill and way more moves and has shard array as an exclusive weapon that is really good, like one of the best weapons inside of the game. In my honest opinion, I could see Quincy Keto going to be the most played thing inside of the game. I wouldn't be surprised at all. Quincy Keto with like balance or something, I don't know maybe a vision not visionary uh miracle something like that could be a very very common build inside like tomorrow because um if the actual quincy keto rework is insane and they have an ultra still yeah we're gonna see it all over the place especially in clan wars and especially in ranked um because it's already good like quincy keto before this rework was already insane so if they make it to where it's even better, does more damage, has more moves, more combo potential, and an ultra skill that will probably do like a bar of damage, and they have the Shard of Ray, which also does a crazy amount of damage and is just a free crit, I don't know. And we have new bows? I don't know, man. I can definitely see Twin Keto going to like the number one build inside the whole game right now. But like I said, if you guys want to see me use it inside PvP, just do this video to like 300 lights, and I'll, you know, change my build that I have on right now to a Twin Keto build. It really just depends um but yeah if you guys end up enjoying it i know it's a real quick video i probably will drop the video on the cybernetic removal npc um in like a minute so if you guys end up enjoying this video like and subscribe and leave your own thoughts on twin skill do you think it will completely change the meta or do you think i'm like overreacting and the meta will still be kendo um but yeah leave your own thoughts inside the comments and your thoughts on these recent codes because i'm not gonna lie these recent codes have been pure bonds but yeah i'll see you guys inside the next video peace